Hey guys, this is Logab123 here, and today uh, I will show you all the new changes that has been made on Blocks World for the new update. So, first thing you will notice is that there will be a new pack soon, thanks to the home screen uh, splash screen and the uh, copyrights. So, uh, as you can see, it seems that it will be a G.I. Joe pack. So, this will be really awesome. I really hope to see that soon. And it should be really cool. Um, especially for the Canada guy. I mean, it's like my, my favorite. Um, so, there it is. The new version, 1.25. Um, as you can see also, a completely new uh, UI new interface so it's really cool and I will get you on these so first let's see all these sections so as you can see there are now subsections uh, that are made so you have your worlds your light worlds uh, just as the profile but you have also a new subsections which is called models and it enables you to save some models and soon you will be able to sell them and to uh, buy some from other players. So that will be really cool. Um, else, there is also the play uh, section for the uh, for the levels and mini games. So these ones are the free ones. So the Spycraft is now free uh, for those who want to buy it. And there are all the other uh, worlds. Uh, you also have the build section, which is your world sections. So instead of my worlds, it's build section, so you can build a new world and see your worlds by the same time. And what's really cool is like whatever, whatever you are, uh, whatever the section you are in, you can just like switch section, and you don't have to press home button every time, just like before. So this is really cool and really amazing. Else, you also have the shop, which uh, now has all its sections in here, and the new explore section. It's the same thing as the shared world section. The only difference is that uh, all the worlds has been categorized. So if you don't have any specifications, just go in all the worlds. Else, you can do in aircrafts, for example, and every world that has the tag aircraft will be in there and by the way this world was shared on Facebook and is really awesome it's a jet plane uh, really cool to control really beautiful you can see all the interior so it's like all the uh, skull of the uh, the plane itself it's really beautiful and this one I just saw uh, really looks futuristic so don't forget to uh, like the world's that you found really interesting. Uh, it uh, it encouraged all the builders to build some more worlds, and it gave them coins to have uh, more awesome, uh, more awesome blocks. Oh, that's cool! A giant whip. That's really nice. So whatever. Uh, now I will show you all the uh, new things in the editor mod. So first we are going to uh, go on the build section and build some new world uh, on the endless expense or whatever the world you want. So first I will show you how to make a model. So to make a model all you have to do is put, is put in some blocks. Just waiting for it to load. It takes some time on my iPad mini. There we go. So just put some blocks. To make your uh, your model, sorry if it's really slow. Uh, when I started, it's always really slow, but it will it will be uh, way faster after this. There we go. Now it's way faster. So just put whatever you want, and then select up some angle that you want it to show on the thumbnail, as you can see. So I'll put it like this. Then double tap a block to select it all. And you still have the uh, purple icon just here that I tap to save your worlds, uh, your model, but it just only saves one. And to save it forever, well, you can press the folder button, the blue folder button, then enter a name. And when you do this, make sure there is no 
return button here. Uh, make sure that just hide your keyboard, your keyboard, and repress it again, and it should have the done button instead. Uh, if you have the return button, it will not save the uh, it would not save correctly the uh, the name of the world, but you will be able to change it on the uh, model section. So just put whatever you want, and then press OK. And now you have to wait. Okay, just wait, and there we go. It appears here. So if you are on whatever the other section, uh, when you once you press done, just wait and it will uh, show up the model section. If you do anything, uh, it may crash the app, so be careful. Uh, just wait for it to show up on the model section, and then after this, you can do whatever you want and put it back to your world, so you can, you can build some insane stuff. So maybe something you uh, had noticed is that uh, all the icons have changed, so it's now way more uh, modernized. Uh, it's really beautiful. I really like it. Uh, it's really fresh. Uh, it's really cool, and it's really awesome. And also, you can see that all the some icons have changed, like all the arrows icons. Uh, some uh, ground functions that has changed names also for hit land or hit block, hit laser. Uh, new color backgrounds for these ones. And the tags also, and if you use the uh, the game blocks, well now the the functions are blue instead of orange, so it's really cool. And all has been reorganized so that when you put the tags, it's w it's way more easier to find what you want. So all the tags things are at the end of uh, the actions section, and if you just tap it. Uh, it will just scroll down directly, so it's really cool. Else, you also have the new buttons that you can change icon for every of them, of every buttons, uh, not the mover, uh, just the mover that doesn't do that. And you have all a bunch of maybe 10 or 12 icons, it's really cool, really amazing. And it changes it for all the uh, buttons that you have that you had before. So, if I put the L button to this. All the L button will do this also, and they will all change at the same time. So it's pretty nice for this. Um, else, you also have uh, new action blocks. So <coughs> sorry for that. Uh, you have two two new action blocks. You have the uh, control block, which has uh, four functions. So the trust function is the new function for fire, but instead of fire, trust is like putting a force on the back so the blood goes forward and uh, that's the only thing that the trust function does whoops sorry for this bug there we go and you also have the hover function right here this is really cool it's the same thing as it's like a mix of the hovers and the uh, stay function of the anti-grav block so it will the block will stay at this height that you can select up but whatever, whenever, whatever the uh, rotation of the block, it will stays at this height. So this is really cool. And you have the easy turn function, the same thing as mover, but uh, it just take the rotation of the mover and it doesn't, it doesn't like go forward or go uh, on the side. It just take the rotation. So that's why it's called easy turn. Now I will hit play to show you guys. Sorry for that bug. There we go. So it's pretty cool, uh, really, really uh, useful, and it runs really perfectly. Also, I have noticed a change for the uh, for the stars icons. Uh, they are now really beautiful, um, more HD. So it's like uh, some small blocks world uh, revolution, and it's really cool having this. So as you can see. It's really, 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 really HD now. Uh, some flat design, really beautiful. Uh, it's really insane, really cool. Um, now I would just quit this before it crashes. <laughs> Sorry for that. I'm on an old device, so the app is now uh, less stable. Uh, well, it's more stable when you play a world, so that was what I really like about it. When I play a world, it runs really more uh, faster, 
but when I edit it and go back home, it of really often crashes, especially when I uh, use models. But however, you can just uh, restart it and everything works perfectly then. So I have a few other things to show you um, on the world. Well, I think it was pretty done, but I would just see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had uh, one more action blocks to show you. Uh, this one was really weighted by the community. Uh, just wait for the app to load. Oh, there we go. Will it loads? Will it crashes? I don't know, but I don't like this. So yeah, if you are on older devices, it's really hard to run. But whatever, there we go, it works. So just open up a new world. And then I will show you uh, the other action blocks. Um, so the, it's the... Well, <laughs> nice. Okay, that was weird. I was able to edit the, uh, the world of the home screen. And that happens also often for me. Uh, <laughs> okay, so whatever, I will show you. So it's the ball. I don't know if you saw the ball. It's like the red ball. It's a rare item. And now it's now uh, on the action blocks. So you can move it. And this is really cool. So you can use the mover just here to move the ball around. Just wait for it to load. <laughs> Sorry for that. And... There we go, so just increasing up, and there we go, so you can move it, it's really cool. Uh, maybe if they can add a jump function, it will be uh, more awesome, so we can do some really cool uh, levels with this. And you also have a stay function, uh, of course, to make it uh, stay when you don't want it to move. So that's pretty is, um, that's all I have to show you. Uh, there is new. There are new icons for the uh, anti graph blocks and the uh, rocket. Um, it's pretty. This. It's really cool. I really like it. New design. New uh, way to see uh, blocks. Well, even if it's a three D games, I think it's more beautiful having like really flat two D design with it. Uh, so it's really cool. Really beautiful. I really like it. Um, so as they said on the new pack, uh, if you buy the new pack, it will be part like of uh, Blocks World Revolution, and I think it's pretty this. It's a uh, revolution of Blocks World, and I really like it. So download the new version if you haven't downloaded it. Else, uh, comment if you want to know specific things about Blocks World. I will be happy to uh, answer. If I missed to say something new about the app, please. Put it in the comment, I will see that and I will maybe do an update video. Else, uh, if you want to get any notifications, subscribe. My channel is lulgab123 and I uh, hope to see you next time guys for another Blocks World video.